walk you through with us the first time that uh, somebody I believe has probably seen the inside of the Midnight Owl Mine and, and got to be got to be 50 years maybe even more uh, brief history this in the 40s and 50s was a lithium mine um, mine for lithium and and uh, produced cold and silver and copper as a byproduct but uh, probably around the early 80s when of course the price of gold went up uh, became a gold mine uh, most of this area was mined for gold because of the high price of metals and uh, it's only been the last couple of years that there's been a resurgence of uh, mining for lithium because the prices have uh, increased due to the increased demand. So I'm walking you up on this mine. Um, probably the nicest thing about it is it's it's pretty pretty secluded. You won't even know you're on it uh, unless you're within a couple feet of it. Uh, it's, it's that hidden, and I believe that's one of the reasons why it uh, remains uh, hidden to this day. I don't know if you can see this. I'm hoping you can. Um, I got in here about uh, five years ago, 2017, and got about 20 feet in and was blocked by flooding. Couldn't go any further, didn't have the right equipment. I'm hoping we get in before this rain hits and uh, we can see what's beyond that. So let's see if I can squeeze myself through here. It's tight. And muddy. Look at that fin. Let's hope there's no snakes. We're in. Came through that about two foot high entrance. You can see there's a few tons of material there that's gonna to have to be removed. Um, we're muddy and we're wet, but it's dry. I mean, at least there's no, no accumulated water. I'll take you through a walk. Oh, some of the cribbing's down. That's always a little bit of a bad sign. But she looks stable. Very easy to see the vein they were following. Right there, right on the spine. Some large stoping. Whoop, got a couple of visitors. The winged kind. We have some standing water in here. I don't know if you can see that, but that's what we came for right there. See all that white material? That's lithium. Silica and aluminum. That's what we're looking for. Now we've got some standing water here. Question is how deep? Cribbing's good here. Let's see if I can get across. It's deep. That's okay. Look at this. I hope you can see that. Just beautiful. Might be too deep to get down to the end, but um, beautiful colors. You can see an actual uh, surface coating of lithium not to be unexpected that's coming back the way we just came from colors in here are amazing years and decades of calcium buildup silica and again aluminum lithium we'll get some readings on here and tag and bag some samples and see what we're dealing with 